1976, I was I was 26. So to be honest, actually, you 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 didn't you didn't think too much about the heat. What you did like about it was that when the weekend come, you knew you could go off down to the seaside or down to the parks. Every summer, from from when I was very young, we used to go to, on holiday to Cornwall. Even though it's 42 years ago, I very much remember the fact that every day was clear blue sky and, and quite hot. I mean, in those days, I would be out on the burnt patch of grass in the centre of London, which is where uh, I was living. You wouldn't dream of putting suntan lotion on, because that was something you did if you went abroad, certainly not in, uh, in Britain, um, and you'd burn yourself to bits, probably. I was a, I'd become a very keen surfer. The problem with uh, hot weather high pressure systems like we have now this at the moment stuck over the country. You don't get any movement in the ocean so the wave, the sea was like a mill pond for absolutely weeks and weeks on end. D during, um, during my time at work in 76 and uh, right into the 80s and that everybody worked in suits so and uh, if you'd walked in during this kind of heat you would walk in absolutely dripping. I, m I remember you know if you walked around London in shorts back in, you know, 40 years ago, people looked at you like you were strange. You couldn't really dress for the heat because, you know, walking about in a bikini in the centre of London certainly uh, was not an acceptable uh, way of going about things. When you got into the office, um, you, you sat down in, in, in your on air conditioned uh, on air conditioned office, and the only thing, if you were lucky, you had a window nearby, you could open that. Very few places had air conditioning, so those that did actually advertised it as something that might attract people in. People were flocking to the cinema, they were flocking uh, to any restaurant that had air conditioning. What you hear now is how long it's going to go on for. Back in 1976, you only knew about today and probably the next day, but now we know it's going to drag on for two weeks. So psychologically, you're gearing yourself up. Back in 1976, you thought, well, you know, okay, it's just going to be another day or the weekend comes and it's going to disappear altogether. Hopefully not. Now I would say, don't worry about the grass. It will grow back. Um, we will be nice and green again. Um, and I say, don't do what I did. Obviously, stay out of the sun, put suntan lotion on um, and keep well hydrated.